Good evening and welcome to Jim Munley's World of Weather. You clicked on to the Long Range Weather Forecast Discussion for October 15th to the 27th. The NAO is forecast to be negative for, for October 15th to the 19th with the PNA gradually fall and trending positive. This should lead to a persistent ridge off the west coast to build over north, northwestern North America. Energy moving into western Canada will lead to a trough over east central North America by the end of the week. A system will be departing the plains and bring cooler air to the, to the plains and the Rockies from the northern and central Rockies into the northern plains. Temperatures would be below normal across the north central states by as much as 15 25 degrees, trending towards below normal for most of the nation. And that's like as we go into day five, you can see we have a broad trough encompassing much of the nation, bringing cooler air. Okay, models are are depicting a trough over the west west of Alaska and a very strong ridge over the northwest, northward into Alaska, and a trough over the central U.S. for October 17th to the 21st. The the European ensembles ha have a trough to the west. Below normal heights are forecast from the southwest and the plains into the Great Lakes. Above normal heights are forecast over the northwest and portions of the east. So during this forecast period, forecasting above normal temperatures here and along the east coast and below normal temperatures across here, across the middle of the nation. For precipitation, forecasting below normal precipitation here, above normal precipitation where the trough is, will be. Now we're going to look uh, further into the forecast period and this is for October 23rd to the 27th. Models maintain the trough west of Alaska and the ridge from the northwest northward into Alaska for October 23rd to the 27th. The GEFS and European ensembles depict some differences with the trough over the nation. Most, models, uh, most guidance indicates some progression of the trough but the European and the GEFS and some ones are less progressive, which brings the trough further to the east. That correlates more with the negative NAO. Now, another um, reason here, going towards um, cooler here, is the MJO is forecast to be in phase six, indicating cool in the west and the east and warm in between. So during this forecast period, I am forecasting below uh, b above normal temperatures for the west coast below normal temperatures for this region for precipitation looking for below normal precipitation here near normal elsewhere so that is the long range weather forecast discussion for october 15th to the 27th thank you for coming to jim monley's world of weather and have a good day